We're in Newark today. <laughs> it's Sunday. We brought the boys for a day out. It's cold. It's very cold. Possibly raining. Yeah, and Mike has got a bow tie on, but you can't see. Hang on. Barbara. Hang on. There we are, Barbara. He's got his bow tie on. <laughs> so yeah, we're in Newark today. It's a steampunk market, which is in the Butter Hall. The Butter Market. Butter Market. So yeah. So we're going to have a wander around, see Karen, see Helen, and then only have a bit of a schmooze. Maybe do some shopping. Oh yeah. Money. <laughs> Well, we stopped for a little bit of lunch with uh, Kay and Alfie and Ella and Duke yeah. and Miss Daisy. <laughs> Miss Daisy's there. So Nippers wait for his daddy to come back. He's not happy. He has had his head on there. But uh, yeah, wait for daddy. What belong? Where's daddy? Look at those ears. What makes you think Bentley's found some food? <laughs> Bentley's found some custard pasta. <laughs> Fancy Karen's pasta. Hello. Hello. <laughs> it's pouring it. I know. Oh, look. <laughs> gizzy, 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 gizzy. I know. I know. Is it pasta? Yeah. So we're back at the car. Mr Nip has had a very busy day today, so has Mr Bentley. They're both extremely tired. We've walked our little legs off and their little legs off as well. So and we've had a nice afternoon with Kay, Alfie and Ella, Daisy and Duke as well. So it's been lovely today. So now we're just on our way home again. So with it being the 11th of December today, I'm expecting when I get to mum and dad's that they're going to ask me to go into the loft um, to bring down all the Christmas decorations. Um, I'm hoping that dad hasn't taken upon it himself to go up there on his own and bring all the Christmas decorations down. Because I'll be very cross if he has done that on his own because <laughs> at his age it's not the safest of things to do so yeah so I'm expecting to do that today It's started. Go on then, let's test the lights. There we hey! go. Excellent. Right, there's nothing wrong with those. Right, let's turn them off again then, so let's get the rest of the tree decorated. Ooh, lights! <laughs> no. Come on, little fella. So it's just me and Mr. Nip again today. Bentley's gone to work with Ian. So 
we're just going out for our own little private promenade so as i was saying <laughs> before mr nip decided to do his business yeah we're um it's just me and him today so nice quiet day so we're having a little bit of an extra long walk this morning even though it's foggy it's not really cold just damp so yeah we're taking advantage of spending some quality time together So it's Wednesday, 5 p.m. and I've just got back in. So today's been a very long and, and very exhausting day. So this morning I went and picked mum and dad up from the house, brought them back here, uh, then took dad down to have his hair cut and I had mine done too. I know. Looks nice, doesn't it? Um, after that, we had lunch together and then I took mum shopping. Um, I took her to one of the big, big supermarkets that has an upstairs with all clothes and that kind of stuff in it. Um, and that just seemed to take forever. <laughs> um, mum's not been the best today as far as memory's concerned. Um, so there's been lots of incidents of conversations which have just, I think she's been having conversations with herself, to be honest. Um, so it's been a bit exhausting mentally. <laughs> when we got back, uh, we had another cup of tea and then I've just taken them home, um, helped mum unpack her shopping. And on Monday, I didn't get a chance to get the Christmas decorations out of the loft for them. So I did that when I got back um, to theirs while mum was unpacking her shopping. And then I've just driven back and it's now dark. Um, Ian's just made me a coffee. With whiskey in it. Shush. No, it hasn't got whiskey in. <laughs> because that's just sort of <coughs> a trying day I've had today. I am mentally exhausted. The sun's bright this morning. Makes a change for it not to be foggy, drizzly. Or raining. So hopefully we'll have a nice walk this morning without getting wet <laughs> or without getting cold. So I've probably just tempted fate there, haven't I? Go on. Go on. Come on. Got another rainbow. I've seen more rainbows living up here than I ever had before my entire life. Come on. Come on, boys. They're slowing down. I think they're getting tired. So it's been a busy old week this week. Um, going through the vlog footage for the week, <clears throat> I realised I hadn't done much for um, up to the weekend. So we'd kind of missed Friday and Saturday altogether, um, which is a bit unusual because normally I do something. Um, but it's been one of those weeks this week where as we're getting closer to Christmas, um, the time is starting to run out to do certain things. Um, like you've got to make sure you've got your orders in for internet purchases to make sure that they arrive in time for Christmas and make sure you've got all your Christmas cards written um, and in the post so that they're going to again arrive before Christmas because there's nothing worse than getting a Christmas card in the new year. <laughs> um, I know at this time of year as well that the post um, is always 
delayed. So anything that you order, no matter what date it says that it's going to arrive, it's always going to be a couple of days after. Um, I'm still waiting for one of Ian's Christmas presents to arrive. Um, and that should have arrived two days ago. Um, but it still hasn't got here, even though um, it was sent via a certain you know, tracked 48 hour delivery service. It's now been, what, five days and it's still not here. So I know there's a large volume of post out there. So you've just got to make sure that you get in there early and get everything done. And I understand why people um, do Christmas shopping and start their Christmas shopping in October. Um, this year, I did. I started buying stuff in October. When I saw things, I thought that'd be perfect for Christmas and then I'd get it. Um, but also I had to make sure that I got birthday presents for Ian as well. So I was doubly buying <laughs> extras because Ian's birthday is in November. Um, so I've got a bit of a sore throat today. Um, so yeah, so as soon as I start thinking about birthday presents for him, I also then start thinking about Christmas presents too. So that, that's just the way my brain works. Anyway, so yeah, it has been a busy week, as I've said. Um, we did finally manage to get the Christmas decorations down for mum and dad. That's all sorted. Um, and also we've got ours up as well. We still haven't got the outside lights up though. Um, and it doesn't look like we're going to do those until tomorrow. Um, because Ian's out all day today and he won't be back until after dark. And they don't want to be putting Christmas lights up in the dark. It's not very safe. Definitely not very safe. Um, but this morning... Um, obviously, boys have been out for a long walk this morning, so they're all quiet and gone back to sleep. Um, it's just approaching lunchtime. So, in fact, it's just gone lunchtime. It's 12 o'clock, just gone noon, I should say. I've not had any lunch yet, but I will be doing in a little while. Um, but what I have been doing this morning, I've been doing the final artwork for the Mission Inspirations for 2024. Um, and I've got up to... The final artwork i've got i had everything kind of done but i wanted just to finish off the artwork and add extra bits to it i've actually done right the way up until um week 26 so i'm actually half of the year done so right the way up until the week commencing um say from monday the 24th of june next year <laughs> So, and I did most of those in the last couple of days. So I've had my nose to the grindstone for the last few days. Um, so, and I shouldn't imagine that it will take much longer to do, because I now know what I'm doing and the format it's taking. Um, it won't take me much longer to do um, all the others as well. So, like I said, I know what the prompts are going to be. I just have to do the artwork for them, if you know what I mean, the little prompt cards, the oracle cards that I want to create. Um, so there's going to be um, there's going to be the prompt, but there's also going to be a I suppose you could call it like an oracle explanation or like a, a mindfulness kind of thing that goes with the prompt. So there's going to be an image, there's going to be the prompt, then there's going to be a kind of explanation for it as well, which may give you additional inspirations for it. Um, so yeah, so like I said, I've done 26 weeks so far. I just have to finish the rest off. Um, plus, I've just done uh, the final mission inspiration prompt for December 2023. So that's it. So that's all of the mission inspirations done for this year. And like I said, I've already started working. I've just updated the header as well on the mission inspiration Facebook group um, to take off the bit where it says two a month first Saturday and, and second Saturday or whatever it is that it said on the header before I've created a new header and put that on as well today so um yeah it's been a busy kind of like few days like I said a busy week busy few days and we've got another couple of busy days coming up as well over the weekend too so yeah it's all good I just hope I remember to take the phone with me and actually record something this time because Fridays and Saturdays always seem to get missed for which I do apologise. So I just wanted to finish the week on a little bit of a high and happy note. So recently I've mentioned a couple of times in videos that I was hoping to reach 31,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So I'm happy to report that I have 
as of this morning, reached 31,051. So a huge thank you to everybody who's already subscribed, keeps on subscribed, but also to those new subscribers that have joined me just recently. Thank you all so much. I'd like to say a huge thank you to all of my angels because without you, these videos would not be possible. And don't forget you can access your exclusive angel only content over on my website. There's a link in the description area below. Thank you.